Hello, my name is Tom Utes. We're here at my uh, studio outside of Nashville, Tennessee, and we're working on a really exciting record. My name is Martin Simpson, and I heartily concur that this record project is very exciting. We've been having, I think, rather too much fun already. It's good. This project started with uh, a fascination that I've had for a long time with Cecil Sharp's collection that's called English Folk Songs uh, from the Southern Appalachians. And I always wanted to do something with it since I uh, got a hold of that book maybe 10, 15 years ago. And I, I never really could figure out what I wanted to do. And uh, I'm not very, uh, I don't conceptualize these things much. I just rather walk around with an idea for a while and, and wait what comes to me and, and then um, the idea to select uh, songs that two women, Jane Gentry and Mary Sands, uh, contributed to this collection uh, sort of came in my head because they lived fairly close to each other but they probably didn't know each other and they, uh, they contributed a large number of songs. And uh, then I got introduced to Topic Records and Topic Records introduced me to Martin and then we shared some ideas who should be involved in this. and. The idea was born to make part of this record here with American folk singers and then go to England and make the rest of the record with, with English folk singers. So we really hear the commonalities of these songs, but also how different the interpretations can be. I went over London's bridge One morning bright and early I saw a maid for by the way I think it's massively exciting to look at the body of work. For me, I've always been as much informed by American music as I am by British music. And in fact, my mother-in-law, um, Val Bailey, found a copy of an old uh, volume of this book in Help the Aged, which is a charity shop in Sheffield, and she gave it to me. I don't know, 10 years ago or something for Christmas. So I was very familiar with the book, but I also have spent my entire life listening to the, the, the recordings, the commercial recordings from the late 20s that were made of people like Buell Kazee who sang this material. And uh, I just was very, very excited to be involved and, and to play and to sing a little bit too. But to play with Tom, <clears throat> which we only did for the first time yesterday, we sat down yesterday afternoon after I'd flown in and we played, we played what we had. And, and the thing that delights me so much is that I don't think I've ever played with a guitar player who is so completely, it fits so well with the way I play the guitar. And I think, you know, for Tom it's the same thing. We don't have to we don't have to do anything but what we do and it just all joins up so beautifully. <laughs> 